Greetings everyone, Brett here. We're back with another five minute review. Today, we're gonna to be taking a look at the RX 78-2 Gundam. This is the version 2.0 recent re recently released kit. Now, I'm gonna say right off the bat that this is a kit that I will most likely be adding to my personal collection. And I was quite surprised opening this box. Now, MRS Hobby Shop retails this kit for about 35 bucks. And having looked at the pricing for a lot of the uh, the other Gundam kits that I've done, this one seems extremely reasonably priced for what comes in the box because I think this is hands down some of the best, most intricate, detailed work that Bandai has done on a Gundam kit to date. Now, take that with a grain of salt just because I haven't obviously looked at every single Gundam kit that exists, but just the, the sheer level of detail and how crisp and sharp it is 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 just wild to me and and i'm just blown away about how how much they have packed into this little kit just in terms of detail because there isn't a surface on this kit that you that will be seen once it's built that is not detailed and technically that even includes the entire underframe underneath the armor it is all well detailed plus like the insides the back sides of different armor pieces are detailed it's just absolutely astounding and i couldn't find any defects any issues any anything in this kit notable in terms of the plastic and it's just every time i took out a new frame and there was always just so much more little details to look at and to you know to to gush over i mean even just you know here's the underframe for for the head and how much detail there is packed into there and so it was just it was it was quite fun opening up each new frame just to see what new detail i could i could discover in here plus bandai is using a lot of slide mold technology in this here like you can see some of that example here that's that's very nice very clean and uh, uh, there's just not enough words that I can come up with to complement how well this kit looks and is is designed. Now, obviously, I, this is not a build review, so I don't know how well it fits, but I I can imagine. You know, here's the exterior portions for for the helmet, and it's just it's crisp, it's clean. The details really stand out in relief to the rest of the 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 plastic. The clear parts are all nice and crystal clear. And so here's here's the main shield, right? Like the main body of the shield, but there's parts that go on front of it. There's parts that go in the back of it, and it's it's impressive. Here's more external armor pieces, and you can just see how many openings there are for additional parts to go on and additional details. Here's like underframe stuff for shoulder pieces, leg pieces, things like that, and I, it's just it's it's fascinating. Fascinating. Also, this kit does not come with poly caps, so all the joints are done plastic on plastic. Just be aware of that, and uh, but you you get very beautifully rendered subframe parts. Here's hand parts. You get multiple different hands: closed fist, open hands, sh you know, gripping hands, things like that. And, and they all look really, really sharp, really, really crisp in their details. Here's uh, under parts for the for the shield for the gun. It's just it's exquisite, and I am absolutely impressed and, and literally just doing this reveal this review absolutely made me want to go out and purchase this kit so the one downside to the kit is that it uses self-adhesive stickers and i mean they look nice and in fact if you look at the foil ones here you can see they actually have embossed details like irises for the eyes okay i'm gonna admit that's pretty cool for the foiled parts but i wish there was at least some water slide decals in here to to detail this up but it is what it is and again for the price i think it works the instruction booklet is nothing new it's standard bandai you start from you know basically start from the top and work your way down the uh there's a lot of um diagrams in there regarding the articulation so it looks like this is going to be an extremely articulated model and nicely you'll be able to do some cool poses things like that so head on over to mrshobby.com go check out this kit and all of the thousands of others like it and we'll see you on the next video. Take care, everyone.